What is up you guys? Nick here with another video. Today I am going to show you how to enable YouTube background play without subscribing to the YouTube premium service and paying, I don't know, what is it, 10 or $12 a month now? Now, of course, if you want this to work in the app, you actually do have to pay for their service. However, there is a trick you can use with Firefox that will enable you to have background play. So again, if you want the full YouTube experience where it's nice and smooth and uses the native code and all that, go ahead and use the YouTube app and pay for the service. This video is not for you. But if you have the occasional video that you like to watch, such as a Nickel Gandhi video where I drone on for a long time and you wish I'd just get to the point, you can do this by way of Firefox and you can listening you can listen to me drone on and do other stuff on your phone while you wait. So to do this, you will need the Firefox web browser which is available from Google Play, but you can also get it from Fdroid and I believe you can get it from mozilla.org. Um, so let's go just Firefox and I just use the standard install version, not the beta, not the nightly, not anything like that. And it is free to download, of course, and you can set up whatever privacy settings you want. And I've already got it open and installed here so that it'll make this video a little bit shorter. But you'll see that you can have YouTube background play going. And I'm not sure how the sound is going to come across on this. So you can see I'm at YouTube.com by way of fire here. I'll actually I'll navigate to it so you know this isn't fake youtube.com hit go and some of you may already know about this method if you do good for you this is for the people who don't know and I'll click on one of my own videos so that I don't get copyrighted and we'll hit go and we'll go and here you can see we'll click on my drain cleaner test video you see the video loads we're loading into full what screen here up, you guys I'm, I'm sure you guys are video. hearing two versions of my voice now, uploaded. but you'll see if um, I hit the I home button. A... Oh, well, it didn't work. Great. Oh, that's because I don't have the add-on installed. Ha! <laughs> Part of this video is showing you how to install the add-on. So here, I'll show you. You need to go to... Let's see, browse Firefox recommended extensions. So I'll show you. I'll put a link in the description to this very web page. It's actually on the front page of Firefox's recommended add-ons, but I'll send you a link to the actual add-on so that you can get it for yourself. So all you have to do is navigate to this web page, click Add to Firefox, and it should tell you, it should prompt you and tell you what it's going to use. Okay, so here it says, it requires access your data for sites in the YouTube.com domain. Well, I'm not signed in, so I'm not worried about that. Access your data for sites in the YouTube nocookie.com domain. Okay, that's fine. Access your data for sites in the Vimeo.com domain. Oh, that's right, this works for Vimeo as well. Um, I'm fine with that, so I'm going to hit go ahead and add, and then we will go back to YouTube and hit play. We had a clog in my hit the home button, sink and, uh, and you can see I'm it's still playing. Drain cleaner. Go back to the and yeah, you know the brand, but I'm not going to say it because I'm not advertising for go them. Go back um, to the it's in there working app store. Right now, well, hopefully and it's working. Let's and stop this fine. dreadful video. I can't believe this thing got 222,000 views. That's insane. Why do you guys watch my content? Anyway, uh, that's really all you have to do to enable the add-ons. Now, since you stayed till the end, I'm going to show you one more trick that you can do, and this will actually block YouTube ads as well. But shh, I'm not advertising that because I don't want to get demonetized. All right, get uBlock Origin by Raymond Hill. I'll put a link to this in the description as well. Get the Raymond Hill one. There were some clones out there that looked very similar that were actually stealing people's data. This is the one that you can trust. Get this one, it'll block ads, and more often than not, it will block ads on YouTube as well. It does not work 100% of the time, but it does work most of the time. So that's kind of nice, especially if you're watching a video that's kind of long, like NickelGandhiCode.org videos that have a lot of uh, ad breaks in them, because they're long. Uh, or if you're listening to like a music playlist or something that's got a ton of ad breaks, then this can be really, really helpful for you too. Anyway, Leave a like on this video if it helped you. Leave comments down below if you have questions or problems or suggestions or want to see other content. If you have any suggestions for other content, go ahead and let me know. 
I'm trying to upload more regularly, but uh, sometimes it's hard for me to think of something to upload about. So anyway, thanks a lot for watching, and I will see you in the next video.